Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, I must be an idiot who owns too much XRP and believes I'm getting an ETF for Christmas. Earlier this week, journalists from Bloomberg tweeted the news that BlackRock had submitted a formal filing with what appeared to be an actual screenshot of paperwork for an XRP ETF. The form even appeared on the Delaware State's website, so it seemed safe to assume that the information was legitimate. BlackRock quickly squashed this rumor, but not before the price pumped significantly and then dumped. How many times are we going to let this happen? I'm not sure if I should even point this out, but apparently it only costs about $500 to fake this information and someone who is halfway decent at Photoshop. Placing the long orders, however, isn't free. Despite the fact that the Department of Justice and BlackRock are now looking into who spoofed this information to probably profit hugely off the price spike, there are rumors that this might have been done to gauge potential interest in the ETF in the first place. Uh, yeah, here's the interest. It's gonna pump. They're all gonna pump. That's it. Safe bet. You could release news that the Binance Smart Chain is doing an ETF and it would pump. But I am personally blown away that cryptocurrency, which was created in antithesis to centralization and control and the banks, is now salivating like one of Pavlov's dogs over the idea that BlackRock and all the other massive financial institutions are going to take part in crypto finally. I can't think of a bigger opposition to the vibe of the anarchist XRP community than hoping BlackRock creates an ETF for their coin. Am I confused, or do you little Q worshippers actually want this to happen? Or just anything to make the price go up? We're all finally admitting that we just want money? Well, good. At least we're finally being honest with each other now. Let's f***ing go. I'm Tupac's of course. Like and repost if you enjoyed this quick and useless crypto news.